Hi all of you. 21st edition of Harrison has arrived. Now exam, upcoming exam for NEED SS. NEED SS 2022. ENI SS 2022. For ENI SS, the number of questions going to be from general medicine is going to be 20 or 25 questions. So only the speciality is the main focus there. So no problem. But what about for NEET SS for 2022? Should we go through Harrison 21st edition, the new edition of Harrison? Will that be an impact in the exam? It can be an impact. It may not be an impact. But what we have planned and what we have prepared to do is as the book has arrived, we want to systematically go through each and every chapter topic wise line by line because this book has arrived for more than five years from the previous edition so lot of changes are expected especially in the investigation and in the management so changes will always happen predominantly on the treatment perspective pathology is going to remain the same because of the advancement in technology there could be changes in investigation of choices so learning about investigation of choices is not going to be a big difficulty but looking into the management perspective needs accuracy so that cannot be just only going through the updates so each and every faculty a speciality faculty in speed have got the book they have started learning and preparing chapter wise topic wise and uh, the class is going to happen according to Harrison 21st edition from 24th April 2022, April, May up to June 5th. It has been scheduled of the 11 major specialities from Harrison. Three days for a speciality. So almost 33 days is going to be planned for classes for full day, almost 300. 30 to 350 hours is the hours that is planned for this session and in between we are going to have grand test based on new edition of Harrison so that in case the exam the questions are going to be taken even 30 40 questions which can be taken from the new edition of Harrison our speed students should not have any difficulty in answering those questions so that should not hamper and that should not bring in difficulty to the students who are appearing for this competitive entrance exam. So that is the reason why we are doing this 21st edition of Harrison in extensive mode and the opportunity for the students is to learn those students who already learned 20th edition this session can be used for a revision for them and revision for updating the new aspects and updates from 21st edition of Harrison and that could bring in a great change in the approach to this exam. And it could be a greatest advantage in case the exam is postponed from June to July or August or September. In case the exam is postponed to two to three months, we have not still had got the notification. We are preparing that the exam is going to be like in the month of June, second week or third week. In case the exam is postponed two to three months later and this exercise will be the game changer. Three months postponed, there are a lot of chances that the questions could be based out of 21st edition of Harrison. So whatever might be, whether it might be asked, may not be asked or likely to be asked, but we are here not to take any chance. So I have requested all the faculties of all the speciality or various speciality. So those are cardiologists or nephrologist or neurologist or an oncologist or a pulmonologist, yes, or an endocrinologist. The speciality people and faculty of speed will handle that particular topic of their speciality like cardiology, neurology, nephrology, oncology, whatever endocrinology, hematology, whatever the speciality topics that are given in Harrison will be covered with the ratio of covering each and every topic and chapter wise in Harrison because for this exam our expectation is 75% of questions that could be asked only from Harrison and Harrison related areas and 25% of questions 
could be targeted from the respective speciality books. That means cardiology, suppose they are asking 15 questions from cardiology. 10 questions could be from Harrison. Rest of 4 to 5 questions could be from Brown World. The level slightly could migrate. Similarly for neurology, 10 questions or 12 questions from Harrison, 4 to 5 questions could be from Bradley. So each and every super speciality level may not be 100% here for 150 paper, but there could be 20 to 25 percent that could be there because only then the selection process can be appropriate is what our expectation. So we are preparing our students and uh, in a way that they are fully equipped for 150 NEET SS 2022. So Harrison 21st edition will be covered line by line thoroughly and changes will be indicated during the class itself. At the same time, 25% of the related speciality of the same chapter could be touched so that any question migrates to the next level or above the standard of Harrison, still our student could answer exactly and will not miss this four to five questions of each speciality that might be or can be asked in the exam. So quick summary. Those who already read 20th edition of Harrison, because our Harrison based classes or integrated medicine, rapid revision in medicine and Harrison live, there are three or four sets of Harrison topic wise already loaded in the app. This is the fifth version of Harrison, that is 21st edition of Harrison, the classes are scheduled. So this class, those who are already prepared well with 20th edition, they can use this class for revision and for updation. Those students have not yet started their preparation for NEET SS, better prepare with 21st edition itself. I am repeating again, those who are already prepared, use this class for revision and updation. Those who are yet to start, start with 21st edition of Harrison itself, you will not go wrong. So it will be a great journey and almost 15 to 20 faculties have put in great hard work and putting in their hard work and uh, going to take a class from April 24th to June 5th and this class is made as a hybrid variety that means a student want to have a physical interaction with the faculty can do it or they won't have an online interaction they can do it. So this class avails you to take a physical face to face interactive session or if you are in remote in any part of this country or the world still you can take up the class because it's going to be streamed online live. So we are trying our level best to give you on the latest updations, latest changes and latest happenings which are happening and to make sure that you are fully capacitated to give any level of competitive exam and the question that is thrown from any part of the content or resources available in the market. So have a great journey ahead. It's always continuous change and continuous process that to be implemented and, uh, and definitely the learning of the updated part of 21st edition of Harrison will be made easy to you and uh, with the way and the kind of classes and the percentage is going to happen from 24th April to June 5th. I wish you all the best and we are always here to support you and help you to migrate to the next stage of your medical career and to choose your dream branch in DM Superficiality. Wishing you all the best.